going to see for the finals sets. So right now, winner's finals, little boy versus Emerald 87 going toe to toe. Going to Jules, and this is winner's finals, right? I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. Winner's finals. Hell yeah. Up there. Yeah, but right now, I mean, a lot of damage early on on to Little Boy, but immediately the man's going to be able to oblige, you know, just pay that one right back, and all of a sudden, you got a Zetter off stage with no resources. Stage dealing with the drop kick. Little boy is not overcome. <gasps> the pity flip. What a pity flip. Oh my god, Anakin's. <laughs> Emerald 87, what the hell? Why are you here? Jesus Christ. I was about to say, <laughs> that this looks hopeless, but not with that kind of technical skill. Yeah, I mean, Emerald 87, once again, going to be able to pull out a lead here. And I got to say, the Zedder's looking good. Shine up strong? No, it's just going to be the Gatling, but damage is damage here. Little boy right, looking and... to repeat that edge guard from before and just get the kill with a fair setup. 100%, they can still like cover a lot of distance. 100% probably not full defense here. Up strong, I'm there we go. Me. I don't know what I, I don't know words. You fool, you counted out Zetter in terms of kill power, and right now Emerald 87. A half in, a, a picosecond. Yeah. I mean, that's all it really takes here. Emerald 87 now off stage though, no resources, but goes for the aggressive angle there. And just like that, going for the platform. No refresh on the double outer, jump. Again, out of resources is looking, see, are we gonna see another Pity flip here. No, I don't think it's necessary. As right now, low boy in trouble. Oh, beautiful parry. No, oh, that was a guaranteed kill. kill. <laughs> no. Yeah, Doesn't but need it. Either Doesn't way, need it. does not need it. You know, simply going to take kills on his terms here. But right now, rock coming in so clutch for Lil boy. Patiency, waiting out Emerald. Not gonna jump into anything too risky here. It's another. Oh, misses the tech. The oh, down B with no hit pause on it. Gonna be so difficult to tech in that moment there. And Emerald 87 gonna be able to take game number one with a little bit of a cheesy ender, but you can see the gears turning between both of these players. Absolutely. Little Boy, it feels like, has established such a strong game plan around getting these edge guards. They just need to find ways to close them out a bit harder. Ooh. Yeah, but right now we're seeing Merchant Port come on in. It's just going to be neutral stage into neutral stage. Because right now, damage into damage for both of these players here. But once again, Emerald 87 going to be able to pull out the early lead. And this is one of the few characters where I'd say if you have a percent lead into Krag, maybe you do have a lead. Because Zedder can just kill Krag. Again, we've seen this edge guard scenario playing out. This is definitely kind of what Little Boy's game plans are evolving around, and Emerald might not have a way around oh, it no. here. Yeah, I mean the down me not quite gonna be able to work on out for emerald 87 chest yet yeah, little boy on the other hand looking to get as much damage off as possible with this stock lead and there we are zetter off stage once again a beautiful fireball to keep yourself on say just long enough here but here come the ford airs no the elden ring not oh quite gonna my work wait out. that neutral throw is actually so clean covering and delaying that timing mix up yeah, but the downbeat from Emerald 87 to just get barely above that up air from Little Boy was also really good. And another parry from Little Boy gonna take Emerald 87 to final stock of this game. Little Boy is just running the show right now. Little Boy's the man of the house, but Emerald taking that kill, getting on the board now. Yeah, I mean, Commentator's Curse coming in clutch there, but right now, one parry to start things off. What can you turn that into, Emerald? Not too much, as Lil Boy right now still going to be getting off as much damage as possible, just looking for as much extra credit as he can. Pillar into jab, still going to be 
such a crazy option that just catches so many of these players off guard. Like, and we're looking for something crazy here? Just racks up a billion percent, but doesn't find that kill there. Looking really hard to find this option. I think right, that was a misinput. No! Oh, no. Yeah. oh, that is going to be game two, though. Yeah, I mean, missed pity flips are always a rough moment, but in the end, M187 still very much in this set. Little boy going to be taking game number two, though. Going to forest floor now. Maybe looking at yeah, that honestly, top last zone. Giving yeah, honestly, I would favor Zetter for this particular stage here. You know, this I would tiny, agree. tiny high blast zones just mean that you get that shine up strong so, so early. Honestly, you know, put another 20% on there. This is shine up strong 20%. Right, who but who needs it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, who needs it when you've got forward air sweet spot? And right now, Bill Boy on the back foot, but once again, Zetter damage is high. Just, oh my god. No double jump. Break the pillar. Is oh, not even? needed. This is it, yeah. Yeah, this stage pick seems to be doing the whole world for Emerald right now. Massive, massive lead. Yeah, and oh you can see God. the shines come on through the damage once again here. 30% and counting for the crag. Still not quite at that kill percent for Zetter. Going to be able to sneak back on stage with the double jump refresh. But right now, landing on the pillar. Break the pillar! Oh my God, I'm going to lose my mind, little boy. <laughs> Another right. pillar landing too, as you were saying that. Either way, Ford Air going to be doing just fine here as... You know, this could be a kill. I mean, both of these players just going toe to toe again and again. Level 87. Right here, in... little boy, you don't want that to be the case if, with this kind of a lead. Oh, just goes for the up strong because, you know, knew that little boy was in hit some, but wasn't quite able to react to the positioning in time. But. Right now, gonna be able to sneak back on stage. Upstrong not gonna come out. The jab from Lil Boy, perfectly timed. But there it is, back air. Upstrong going to do just fine. Loop him up into that, uh, uh I forget the literary device, but into that top blast zone we were talking about. Finally, it finally made the difference. Game four now, moving on to kind of a polar opposite. Fire Capital looking for that big, big stage, those big, far away blast zones. Yeah, it's another one of those stages where Crag very much can make use of his huge amount of, you know, heaviness. And you can see right there, triple digits getting tagged by Consume Upstrong, still not going to be killing. You need at least another 20% on top of that one. But right now, I'm old 87 looking to cook up a beetle just going to continue to fire off those fireballs just keeping this wall out with the uh, rock here not letting uh emerald get much pushing him off stage oh that top blast of is so big yeah i mean Going good di ways. from emerald but a beautiful cancel on that up strong had it consumed that would have surely been a kill but once again, here we go, off stage. Yeah, these forward airs were so good from Lil Boy, but Emerald still looking to do so much more. No one's dying. There it is. What was that, 180? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, but 194, honestly, I would be surprised to not see a Gatling. Honestly, just an up air at this point, too, right? Yeah, up air, Gatling, forward air. Honestly, any sweet spot you could ask for on Zetter would lead into a kill right now. But that's the beauty of this stage. Up strong, consumed, and doing just fine, fine though. So fast. <laughs> yeah, but right now, little boy is just flying across the stage, whether it be in hit stun or in advantage. 
Another one of those parries is barely gonna miss out. Up tilt, Ooh. up air. Oh my lord, Jesse's Jesse's soul continues to live on. Get gacked. <laughs> I guess so, but right now still Ooh. looking for the opportunity. Ford air not gonna do it. Drop down, no. And you can Threat see the just little going, bit. What of it. if I do go down with up special? Just yeah, I making mean, making little boy flinch there for the sake of it. Emerald, you can see, is a little bit hesitant on these pillar opportunities, but right now, still in quite a bit of troubles. Shine up strong, no, Gatling, still not going to do it. Up air, sweet spot on the Gatling, on the other hand, will. Just closing in, yeah, Little Boy just keeps looking for these escrow scenarios. I think Emerald's kind of getting privy to it, not letting him come for free. Oh, beautiful shine, but not quite able to turn that into a kill just yet. Good DI out to avoid the up air. Even doesn't kill the, this hot blast zone is kind of going nuts this match. We've seen so many kills just not denied or denied because of it. Yeah, and right now, you know, about 30% away from Gatling kill percent, but very much close to uh, that, you know, shine up strong kill percent here. And right now, another pillar opportunity. Ford Air going to be putting Lil Boy in a rough position back onto the pillar, though. Still has no pillar, still needs a way back on stage. Gonna be able to find it. Up Air not gonna connect, and the consume will do it. Emerald 87, winner's side grant. My god, that match. That final interaction off on that side pillar was absurd. Mm -hmm. That was some of the most insane stuff. And then the best thing is, is it wasn't even enough to get the kill. Little boy was ready for it. And the yeah. end, uh, Emerald does take it there. Mm -hmm. And right now, Little boy honestly had so many flashes of brilliance, though. And going to be the fact that the man's dropping down into losers is 